the most direct way towards the content in the lab system is writing plain HTML. And when you write plain HTML, you probably also want to write some style sheets sometimes to make some formatting to your elements, like when you make a table or certain headers or some things you want to have highlighted in the same way in all your pages, then it's useful to use cascaded style sheets. And um, as the HTML tidy included in PHP formats and corrects HTML, does tidy for cascaded style sheets. And in this screencast, I just want to show you how it works. So we go here and uh, yeah, so we'll, we'll just create the style first, which we don't have yet. So yeah, let's take this one here. Span um, class highlight. And yeah, we want to re um, define this now. So where's the span here? So of course you could also write divs or whatever you want and just make sure you have like a unique name here. And so now I save this and when we go back to the page, we see nothing of course because the style is not defined. But now I will um, go upwards and edit the style sheet and I will just stir it at the beginning. So we just add this and you can always prepend the uh, content area tag so that you don't interfere with the namespace from outside because everything in this white part here is inside the content area. So when you add this as a prefix, then you're always safe in using the names as then you can use almost all names you want to. Okay, so now we just, uh, oh yeah, okay, let's, uh, let's uh, maybe do some errors. Okay, so let's set the background color to red. So that's zero, 0, and the front color to white. So we use FM. And oh, yeah, okay, so I will I'll show you another nice thing. So, um, as you might know, you can use the short forms here, but the CSS tidy will also like pack the content and will fix that in there. Okay, so then I press like on save. So um, now we see that the fixing was uh, not as intended. So here we had a pre tag, and it was assuming we had a pre front tag. Okay. So as you see directly, good. And so here you see like what what was changed. And um, yeah, as as you might have seen, it it changed here the the colors to as short as possible. Save again, and now it works. And now I go back to um, CSS tidy. Okay, because now the user just is back. Okay, and as you can see now, our our style is now working here, and uh, yeah, as expected. Okay, so now I remove it again. So I go to the style sheet and just remove the style again. Save it and go to the demonstration modeling and uh, uh, okay now the slide is gone again and I also remove the text and then um, the page is as it was before I showed you and now it's done. So yeah, and you could of course have used all, all elements. You can use a normal HTML page. All right. So for those of you who want to define the style sheets, this um, is quite a neat feature, I think, and it also keeps the style sheets small. So yeah, I like it. All right then. Enjoy the system.